everybody I thought I'd come on and do an update on my Book of Shadows progress uh, if you watched the video I had done previously you, you would know that I'm making my own Book of Shadows and I was going to use a blue book I have actually changed it now to this red second hand book because I find that the blue book was actually too long vertically for the paper I wanted to use so this is the book that I am going to use so it's got a red cover I don't think it's going to stay red but that's how it is at the moment and I've already taken all the pages out so all I'm left with is the shell so I've got the spine here and the two covers the spine is very very flimsy it's just a cardboard so I'm really going to have to strengthen this up before I actually start putting um, the pages in so I will be using one of my trusty favourite boxes is a dog biscuit box which might get the benefit the dog likes these and then I get to use the nice sturdy box so I'll be using that to strengthen the spine and probably some tape as well and the pages from the book are still all intact so I could actually read this book if I wanted but I don't want to so these will be getting recycled into other craft projects probably um, decoupage collage or paper beads so that will not go to waste it'll get used so i'm thinking that i'm going to be painting the outside of the book and probably the inside as well i'll start with a coat of gesso just to seal it all because i'm not sure if i'm going to use acrylic paint yet or watercolors or a mixture of both i'm not sure yet and the same inside as well i shall give it once i've strengthened the site the spine I'll give it a coat of gesso because the more I add to it the stronger it's going to get and then I shall be adding in my pages so I ended up with four signatures and in total this gives me 240 pages so that is going to keep me going for quite some time the only thing I need to do to these pages now is to trim them down because obviously when you're stacking paper in Uh, the, the paper inside is going to start sticking out a little bit so I'm going to be trimming it down to the size of the top page here so I get a nice even layer of pages there and some of the pages didn't actually cut very well so they're a bit rough in some areas so that should sort that problem out as well sorry about the light we've got kind of a grey sunny day here today and the light's a bit weird but it's coming through the blind so that's why we've got this mottled effect here but anyway that is the progress of my book of shadows so far i hope you're enjoying seeing the progress of it and that you'll join me again to i've got a frog in my throat <coughs> excuse me uh you'll join me again to watch how it's coming along maybe the next time it'll have been painted the spinal have been strengthened um, I'm going to be doing some stamping on some of the pages to give it some interest or it might be completely finished I don't know just depends on what my mood takes and how much I get done in the one time so anyway thank you very much for watching and um, I hope you will join me again for the next one have a lovely weekend and blessed be bye